Hey everyone, it's Matt, and today I will be reading to you various facts about space and our universe. Space, as you already may know, is a pretty crazy place, so I thought it would be fun to As you can see, I've decided to put my face in this video for once. So now you can see what I look like when I'm whispering into this pair of rubber ears. Anyway, I hope you enjoy it. Let me get out my facts here. No. They're all on my phone. Gonna go ahead and read them now. One day on Venus. The sun is over 300,000 times larger than Earth. Due to a lack of gravity, you become taller in space. I believe the number I found was uh, two inches taller. Astronauts come back to Earth two inches taller, and then they, I think they shrink back down, I'm not sure. Although Mercury is the closest planet to the sun, it is not the hottest. Venus is. Due to a process called cold welding, metal bonds to itself in the vacuum of space. A single spacesuit costs 12 million US dollars. According to astronauts, space smells like seared steak, hot metal, and welding fumes. Astronauts on the International Space Station witness roughly 15 sunrises and sunsets every day. The International Space Station travels at 17,500 miles per hour. There is a floating water reservoir in space containing 140 trillion times as much water as the Earth's oceans. There is a Velcro patch inside an astronaut's helmet that serves as a face scratcher. NASA has discovered stars that are cool enough to be safely touched. Saturn's rings are made up of bits of dust, ice, and rock. space, the sun actually appears white to our eyes, not yellow. Tortoises were sent to the moon before humans were. It is impossible to whistle in a spacesuit. I wonder why. The first cat went to space. Astronauts in space cannot tell if their bladders are full. As a result, they routinely relieve themselves every two hours. Footprints and tire tracks left on the moon will stay there indefinitely due to a lack of wind to blow them away. A 200 pound person would weigh 76 pounds on Mars. Neutron stars can spin at a rate of 600 rotations per second. There is no sound in space. The sun contains 99% of our solar system's mass. The largest asteroid ever recorded was measured at nearly 600. Milky Way is just one of billions of galaxies in the universe. The furthest galaxies from us are traveling away from us at over 90% of the speed of light. That's really fast. If you fell into a black hole, you would stretch like a piece of spaghetti. That's kind of a fun visual. Not, well, not fun, but interesting.
Yes, interesting. Our galaxy will collide with the Andromeda galaxy in about 5 billion years. The Milky Way is a central core contains a supermassive black hole. It is commonly referred to as Sagittarius A, and it contains the mass of about 2.6 million suns. right. Not 400 trillion. 400 trillion trillion. That's a lot of beer. There's an asteroid called Chariklo in our solar system that has rings like Saturn. There is a planet that may be made entirely out of diamonds. I wonder how much that would be worth. One spoonful of matter from a neutron star would weigh about one billion tons. Every 15 years or so, a trick involving sunlight causes it to appear to us on Earth as if Saturn's rings have vanished. The last time this happened was in 2009. That same photon only takes eight minutes to travel from the sun to your eyes. Thirty-three light years away, there is a planet that is completely covered in burning ice. An estimated 275 million stars are born every day. Every year, the moon moves about 3.8 centimeters away from the earth. Every century, the Earth's rotation slows about 17 milliseconds. On planet HD 189733b, that's an easy name, shards of glass rain down from the sky sideways. If you could fit Saturn into a bathtub filled with water, distance covered by light in a single year is equivalent to six trillion miles. The farthest confirmed galaxy to date is called EGSCS81. It lies about 13.1 billion light years away from Earth. Due to the amazing coincidence of the moon being 400 times smaller, and 400 times closer than the sun, they both appear to be the same size. The core of a normal star reaches 16 million degrees Celsius. A single grain of sand this hot would kill a human from 150 kilometers away. However, there are some stars in space that are cool enough to bake cookies. Gravitational lensing is a phenomenon in which gravity bends light. As a result, distant objects in space appear to be in a different place than they really are. Las Vegas is the brightest man-made place that can be seen from space. Mercury and Venus are the only two planets in our solar system that do not have any moons. We are aware of only 14 black holes in space. The highest mountain known to man is the Olympus Mons, which is located on Mars. Its peak is 15 miles high, making it nearly three times higher than Mount Everest. 64 moons orbit Jupiter. A Martian day lasts 24 hours, 39 minutes, and 30 
each moon in our solar system to orbit in the opposite direction of its planet is Neptune's moon Triton. Any free-moving liquid in outer space will form itself into a sphere because of its surface tension. The International Space Station circles the Earth every 90 minutes. Stars seem to twinkle in the night sky due to the light being disrupted as it passes through the Earth's atmosphere. In the northern skies, you are able to see two galaxies. These are the Andromeda Galaxy and the Triangulum Galaxy. The largest star known to man is R136A1, which has a mass of 265 to 320 times that of our Sun. The first artificial satellite in space was called Sputnik. stardust because the carbon, nitrogen, and oxygen in our bodies come from long-lost stars created 4.5 billion years ago. The universe is 68% dark energy and 27% dark matter, none of which has been observed by us. The sun is 27 million degrees Fahrenheit at its core. On Venus, the sun rises in the west and sets in the east. Snoopy is the official safety mascot of NASA astronauts. You can fit all the planets in our solar system between the Earth and the moon with room to spare. The sun creates a solar wind that blows at 450 kilometers per second. Magnetars, or magnetic stars, have such a strong magnetic force that if you get close enough, they can rip the iron from your red blood cells. perspective, the lowest sound humans can hear is 20 hertz, or 20 fundamental frequencies a second. Contrary to popular belief, you cannot actually see the Great Wall of China from space. The only living thing on Earth visible from space is the Great Barrier Reef. The moon is 240,000 miles away from the Earth and traveling there takes three days. The International Space Station is the size of a football field. If it was possible to look out from inside of a black hole, the entire universe would be visible in a single patch of sky. bigger when it is close to the horizon due to an optical illusion called a Ponzo illusion. Basically, I think the way it works is when the moon is close to the horizon, we have objects like buildings and other things to compare it with, and so our brains make it seem bigger to us, whereas, our, well, whereas when it's in the sky. looks so far away that we just see it as being smaller. At least I think that's how it works. The moon dust smells like spent gunpowder. Asteroid fields are much safer to fly through than you'd expect, 
as they're mostly made up of very small objects with hundreds of thousands of miles between them. The closest point in a comet's orbit to the sun is called perihelion. The most distant point is called aphelion. Comets are usually made of frozen water and supercold methane, ammonia, and carbon dioxide ices. Those are mixed with rock, dust, and other metallic bits of a solar system debris. Material streams from comets populate the comet's orbit. If Earth or another planet happens to move through that stream, those particles fall to Earth as meteor showers. The longest a total solar Each day, more than 100 tons of material from asteroids and comets falls towards Earth. Most of it is destroyed by friction as it passes through our atmosphere. If something does hit the ground, it is known as a meteorite. There is a theory that the moon was once a piece of the Earth. There is a giant red spot on Jupiter believed to be a 200 to 300 year old storm three times the size of the Earth. It's a big storm. The average surface temperature of the moon is 107 degrees Celsius during the day and negative 153 degrees Celsius at night. The sun weighs about 2,000 trillion trillion tons, roughly 300,000 times the weight of the Earth even though it's made mostly of hydrogen and helium, the lightest gases in the universe. And that is it. I'd like to thank you for watching, and I hope you enjoy that. And hopefully you enjoy seeing my face for once. Uh, can't guarantee that I'll keep showing my face all the time, but I'm going to make a point of showing it more. Either way, I hope you are relaxed and sleepy or 